Predictions about a coming wave of evictions have been dire, especially considering the moratorium on evictions ended this weekend. But an Arizona Landlords Association says not so fast on the eviction forecast. Linda Williams joins us live to explain. Linda? We have heard the predictions that a tsunami of rental evictions is headed straight for Arizona and the country. But today we spoke to a local landlords association that says they're looking at the numbers and that's not what they're expecting. Evictions by the Maricopa County Constable were down dramatically in 2020 due to the pandemic and the eviction moratorium. This eviction last October spotlights the desperation of people who are being forced out of their homes. I'm going to sleep in my car. Will the end of the eviction moratorium this past weekend send a new wave of rental evictions flooding through Arizona? The head of the Arizona Multi-Housing Association says no. From what we were hearing from our members directly, um, we don't see 2021 eviction filings and eviction numbers being much more different than, than they were pre-pandemic. Enhanced unemployment and stimulus checks helped keep many renters afloat, says Gilstrap Levinas. She says while renters and landlords have worked together to prevent evictions, some renters will likely face eviction. It's um, the renters that we refer to as kind of ghosting renters that aren't having any communication. We don't know if they're applying for rental assistance. Um, we don't know if they're trying to get assistance elsewhere. And those are the renters we're most concerned about. The AMA is encouraging landlords to help renters tap into the $900 million rental assistance fund for Arizona. Only $86 million has been allocated, due in part to bureaucracy, says Gilstrap Levinas. So truly, there's no reason we should have any evictions um, with this amount of rental assistance in Arizona. We've Linda Williams, Fox 10 News.